Hi! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's been a long time since I've came here and uploaded a video. And please don't mind any noises like this one. I've bought parrots, like a pair of parrot, and they're really noisy. This species is Budgie. Um, I don't know how to pronounce the full name, but they are mostly known as Budgie and um, they're really noisy when they're happy and I know they're happy I cannot keep them back like bahar. I cannot keep them outside because it's really cold there and my room is quite warm and they love being in a warm place so without any more blabbering let's jump right into the video so today I'm going to share a makeup haul with you guys and this I have bought I think so three or four months back I guess I don't know when was Diwali I I just don't remember I bought it near Diwali and I kept on receiving parcels I collected them and a few days back I opened them opened them so I'm gonna show what I have bought let's start with Colourpop only I'm gonna start with Colourpop because there's a lot of stuff from Colourpop because there's a lot of stuff from Colourpop like Oh my god, this packaging is so sweet. This is so sweet. I got two parcels from Colourpop and two of my products are missing. I don't know how, but I do have them in my invoice also. It's not their mistake. I remember I received them. Um, I checked my Instagram story in my archive. I went there and I literally checked if um, the products were there and both the products were there in the parcel but they got misplaced i don't know how but i'm not able to find them so leave it aside so first thing that i have got is man when i saw this i was like should i be disappointed or should i be like heart melted i was confused like i ordered the beauty blenders or what are they even called precision blending sponge and look how small they are they're so damn tiny like look at the packaging this is how small they are they're so small and i was they should be a they should have called it like mini beauty blender or something like see how small is this like see how small is it but this is so cute and it's really soft i believe like this may expand a lot i just believe i'm not sure now i'm not gonna do it right now do follow me on instagram i always give updates there so follow me on instagram and i'll update you with everything i'm not gonna do everything here because i know this video is going to be really long so you can follow me on instagram and get all the updates like how i use these makeup products what i what makeup looks i create so stay tuned for that and so i got two of these i don't know how much do they cost no idea i'm gonna link the website down below you so you can go and check it out there and next i got two of these lip oils love them i bought one of them earlier and i really love them so i ordered two for me and i guess i think so they both are same shades no this is the blossom out and this is the local time uh, i'm gonna show you how they look like so this is the um so this is the which one is it this is the local time it's just a lip oil there's like no shade in particular and this is the timed out i guess no it's blossom out timed out it's blossom out and it's a little more light in shade but as in as i told you this shade doesn't matter it's just an oil with a little bit of tint but it's not even visible next i got two brushes um one is just a blending brush and one is more like precision pencil brush i guess and they're really soft i really love the quality i might be ordering more because these are extremely affordable like i think so this is going to be on my top list after cups and lashes definitely for like affordable um high quality makeup brushes so next i got only one pair of lash i just wanted to try their lashes so i got just one pair i and this is the mommy shade 
shade and the lash name is mommy and this is how it looks like but it's not natural hair it's not synthetic it's not natural hair i don't know what is this i don't know what is this but it's not natural hair or synthetic lashes at the same time these are not even plasticky but the quality is good but i don't know what what is this made of i have zero idea next i got the liquid highlighter from colourpop so this is the colourpop liquid highlighter and I just it has like a pump in this manner oh my god so this shade is champagne bubbles and i don't even know how many shades are there so these are single eyeshadows that i've got these are like pressed glitters and then single mattes so um this is the shade full effects glitter and this is the shade uh, high it says high like is it visible it says hi <laughs> the way i say hi <laughs> and this shade i'm not going to pronounce it it's like it's really tough it's really tough you can just see it and it's the mambo this will look so pretty as a blush i guess it will look so pretty as a blush so as these are single eyeshadow so i got a mini palette it's empty it's like a magnetic palette for your single eyeshadows like single pans and i can just stick it on them wait i'm gonna show you right now i'm gonna stick it right there and it's on it so this is a really uh, convenient method to you know kind of customize your palette and you can make your own palette of your own favorite shades usually these type of palettes get really expensive but i think so colourpop made it really affordable these were really inexpensive i think so this was for 2.5 dollar that's it and this is uh, this magnetic palette was also for 2.5 dollar so you can imagine it's really inexpensive so this is how it looks like basically this is now like a nine um pan palette so i'm definitely gonna add more there is no color story i'm really sorry but i just wanted um, a palette where i can store my singles because it's gonna be really messy to like store them i know i'll misplace them and then later i'm gonna blame myself so this is like a more convenient way to keep your singles and i think so colourpop had made it really easy for you to customize your own palette your own eyeshadow palette so you should be looking for colourpop if you are interested in customizing your palette making your own palette go for colourpop next i got these eyeshadows like basically these are the rest no these are the super shock eyeshadows and one is in the shade like a shot and one is in the shade ladybird so this is the ladybug and this is how it looks like yeah this is so stunning i would love to use this as my highlighter wait i'm gonna do it right now let me try i definitely need a mirror man i'm looking in my like tv like i have a tv screen behind my setup where i've set um screen mirroring what i've done this is not perfect oh god i don't care now i've done a mistake and i, I don't care so this was the shade ladybug and here is the shade like a shot this is more golden i guess this is also really pretty these are really pretty this is like the jelly thing i don't know what is this called this is the jelly shadow i guess it's really famous and this is the jelly shadow um shade is mystical and this is how it looks like i'm gonna take a little product this is how it looks like man this is so good this is so freaking good oh, i'm not able to see anything man 
I'm not able to see anything. That's the biggest issue. So this is how it looks like. It glistens really well. This can also be used as a highlighter, man. It's quite, but it gets dried really fast. So you gotta work very quickly. It's like completely dry. I can't even move the product anymore. Even the shimmers, I'm not able to move. Next, I got another brush. Uh, this is, I don't know, I guess this is like a powder brush for baking or dusting off the baking. This is how it looks like. And yeah, I don't remember their prices as already said. You can, these are all the lip products. I'm gonna quickly unbox them and I'm gonna show what it is. Because individually, it's gonna take a lot of time. So now all the lipsticks unpacked. The very first is a lip primer. It sounds crazy why I bought this. And I was just curious, like what's special in a lip primer? Like what's really special in a lip primer? Does it make any difference? Or does it hide your creases on your lips? So it fakes, like if you have got fillers done, I gotta see. So that's why I got the primer. It's completely clear. It has no color. I mean, it's white, but it's clear. It's not going to be white, of course. <laughs> Next, I got a red lip liner. This is in the shade Bossy. And here is it. It's just a red lip liner. I don't have a red lip liner. All the red lipsticks that I have from Too Faced, Mellow Cosmetics, um, the MAC one, they all are so extremely watery. And they like... They just overflows. I don't know how to describe it. It just overflows. <laughs> you need a lip liner to work with it. And red lipstick can never look good if it's messy. <laughs> I got just a tint and this is how it looks like. I don't know how it's gonna work. Ah, it's just like baby lips. <laughs> Honestly, it looks, it's exactly like baby lips, but just a little more tinty than that. And it's really soft, it's really smooth. It will work great as like a lip balm, like a tinted lip balm. It's really soft and buttery. <laughs> so this is the Songbird. This is the lipstick. You know Indian makes fun of it, but it's actually a word. Like lipstick, me of lipstick, lippy. And it's in a stick form, so it's lippy stick. Don't make fun of me, okay? So this is how the songbird shade looks like. It's Next, I got another lip liner in the shade Obvi. Obvi? I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm gonna show you the shade name. Shade I've already showed you. Like, how do you even pronounce this? I don't even know if it's visible. But yeah, it's a nude shade. Next, I got the limited edition. I guess this is the limited edition one with Aladdin something related to disney i don't remember i said i don't remember anything so, so this is the shade worthy valley and this is how it looks like it's really warm 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 brown it's not red it looks a lot rusty red but it's not red at all i don't know why camera is picking it as red but this is warmy brown shade with a rusty hint to it like it looks uh exactly like huda beauty icon but a little more rustier than that that's what it looks like it's not red why you are picking it as red man <sighs> my camera sucks next i got this shade i love this the shade name is i love this and this is how it looks like see it's a really hot pink i don't have this shade i don't know why i ordered it Maybe it looked different on screen. I don't remember, but this is how the shade looks like if you want to buy it. And the last lip product is a lip gloss. This is the ultra glossy lip. And this is how it looks like, man. This shade is a bomb. The shade is definitely bomb. So this is how the shade looks like. And the last lip product from Colourpop. I ordered three of them, Was one was in black and one was brown or maybe blue, I don't even remember, brown or blue, I was, I was confused in both of them so I don't remember which one I've ordered, which one I've received, which one I've opened, it was like month back, like months back I guess, two, three months back, so I'm only left with the red one 
I don't know where I've kept both of them. I've I'm tired of like finding them, but I couldn't find him. So it's like misplaced or stolen or I don't know what. But this is the only one that I'm left with. It's the red one and this is called Try Me. That's all it says. And this is the shade name, I guess. Try me. So this haul is done for the color pop. <laughs> not the haul entirely is done so next is now nika i don't know why i have it here maybe i forgot but this is the color bar um spotlight illuminating lotion i haven't used this yet i don't know why i've kept it here but this is also a new buy but i've already shown it in my instagram haul like a story haul video back so the first product that i got is the mac fixative this is the matte one i already have the gold light one it was my first fixative ever really loved it so i went for the matte one also this is how it looks like i don't know when i hold this i feel like really expensive <laughs> i don't know i never felt same with the smashbox one and i know i think so the smashbox one smashbox one is more expensive i don't even remember i don't know so with this I shopped for um, another lipstick and this is the Devoted to Chili. I already have this one in bullet lipstick. It got misplaced. So I ordered one in the liquid form. Like this is the Powder Kiss liquid lipstick. My first ever powder lip lipstick. <laughs> I don't know what I've ever said, what I've said, but the formula looks really pretty, honestly the formula looks legit pretty it looks really pretty i know i'm really bad at swatching right now man so this is how the shade looks like i don't have my mirror with me right now and all i'm completely dependent on my tv screen so that's why i'm really sorry <laughs> i can't see anything clearly it's really far away so I bought these two products and with these two I got one lipstick and this cute pouch tree. This is so cute and it's pink inside. And I got a lipstick free. This is the topped with brandy. Topped with brandy. I hope you see it. And I'm wearing it right now. I really love this shade. I was wearing Bombshell from Huda. Then I switched to this shade and I love this one more. So I've already, you can see it here, no need to swatch. So this is how I got for free. This is so cute. I can store both of my lipstick there. So cute. I got next, I got one, this um, highlighter palette from Laurel. I don't know why I saw this and I was like, this looks bougie. <laughs> and I got this. So the first shade is the Moonlight, then it's Oh My Gold, then Pink Pearl, and the last one is a Brown Blaze, this one. So these are all the four shades, the, all four are highlighters. I don't think so, I'm gonna use the first one, that is the Moonlight one, it's, it's too much. <laughs> but definitely I'm going to use the last two, even the second one, it's, it's really good. So next I got four products from Pack. this is the concealer brush. Again, my stuff is going misplaced. I don't know how someone has stolen it or it got misplaced. I don't know. You remember I had the 272, I guess, um, makeup brush, oh, sorry, concealer brush that I've, so, show, that I've shown in my earlier haul. I got misplaced or stolen. I don't know. But what happens to my accent? But this is the pack um, concealer brush. This is not the 272. I really miss 272, but it's out of stock. And this is um, 215. This also looks quite good, but I don't know if it's as good as 272, but it's an excellent concealer brush. If you guys are looking for a concealer brush. Next, I got the pack 005. This is a foundation brush, like a kabuki brush. And this is giant. This is really giant. <laughs> this is so big. This is so big. I never thought like this big um, foundation brush. It's, I don't know if it would be easy for me to work with this, but it's really big. It's really huge actually. And it's a kabuki brush like flat top always a good quality if you're believing pack 
so the other two items that i got from pack are the lashes um this is the pack 58 and this is the pack n79 my tv n79 so these are the pack lashes that i've got this one is my favorite this one is every single makeup artist's favorite i know i know i know you this is the favorite lash so another product that i got is the huda beauty demi matte liquid lipstick this is the shade bows man this looks so different in comparison to another boss that i know like bows shade it's pronounced as bows um i'm gonna show it right now the smashbox one of course it's a red and i think the red suits perfectly to be named as bows but this is a really different shade i never i've never worn this type of a shade so i ordered it man this shade is this shade is something i could never ever ever imagine myself wearing so that's the reason why i bought it i wanted to wear it and i want to know how i look how i look like in this oh my god this is not from nike of course this is my my little cute babe i love her so much man i love her so much so this is the gurish lipstick it's in collaboration with i don't know what brand it is I know what brand it is but I don't know how to pronounce it and I don't want to pronounce it either. I know you guys going to laugh at me. <laughs> so this is the Gurish lipstick and this is in the shade Beauties. This is more like a coral shade. I asked her like I'm looking for a good coral shade and she recommended me her lipstick, the Beauties, and I was like let's buy it. And this is how the shade looks like. This is the perfect shade that I asked her. I it's like a perfect color that I was looking for. And thank you so much for recommending me this color. This is so pretty. This is so damn pretty. I'll definitely wear this one too. Follow me on Instagram. <laughs> so last I got these two free samples. As usual, Mac always Mac is like free me baat rahi hai cheese. Faaltu ki padi hunge paas. And I I have always kept them for traveling. Like I don't know when I'm going for traveling now. This makes me really sad. So next, I got a, a Nike lipstick, and this is in the shade Dirty Peach, and it's a red shade, 45M. It's a red shade. That's all I can say for it. <laughs> it's just a red shade. And next, I got a another lip lip liner. I said I didn't even remember anything. I ordered two red lip liners. one from color pop and one from me baby and it's a, like a nude um coal pencil for like waterline it's color icon i guess is there any brand named as color icon i'm like i think so i've lost my memory entirely that's what i think i've lost my memory entirely and this is the liquid lipstick that i've got from nike like I don't know what sale was it. It was Diwali or what was it? I don't remember. So whenever this was like relaunched, I bought this and it has both the shades. Um, they have shade changed the shade. I think so earlier it was Babel or no, it was Stepping Out. I guess I don't remember. But this time it's Babel Out. Driver seat already have this man. This is so cute. my driver seat is almost finished like the full size one so i got to order one more because i'm not going to use this one man this is cute for traveling it's really sweet and this is the stepping out it's like more a soft pink but one thing that i've noticed this is exactly like gulabi i saw like sobita have created her own shade like that's what smashbox have told like they have shade um created a universal shade for the women of india and that's gulabi but it's exactly like stepping out there is not even a hint of difference when i swatched them they look exactly the same so i don't know but they look exactly the same i don't know if somebody else can find the difference if you do please let me know but they do look the same exactly the same and these are two shades and next lipstick that i've got from nike guys the ultra matte range and it's the shade same jane whatever you want to pronounce it it's jane right yeah why it's in c 
it's a really 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 pretty brown man it's a really pretty why is this looking like orange like rusty orange oh man my camera is my camera hates me so this is a really pretty brown my camera hates me i know so this is how the color brown looks like it's exactly like this exactly and now it, even this is looking last product of the haul is the wheat sensitive touch it's an electric trimmer expert yeah so haven't used it ever of course and uh, we'll definitely give it a try how it works if this one is for your face and your brows and this one is here for body I and mean, everywhere else whatever you want to shave so a trim so this one i'm really curious about because i think so trimmer for your face is too much i guess so i really wanted to give it a try and i bought it and we'll try it and let you guys know how it if i liked it or if i don't if it's good for beginners or you guys should go for blades first like a normal um eyebrow shapers and like facial blades or you should or you can like directly go to this i don't know if it, that makes sense or not so if you want to see how this works so that was all about the haul i'm not gonna shop for next four years now i guess so this was an extremely long video and i know i wasn't making an eye contact with you guys because i'm constantly looking at my tv screen i hope you can understand so done with the haul entirely i'm really exhausted i'm going back to sleep and i'll see you guys in my next video love you <laughs>